Hello everybody, welcome to my first unboxing video for some Resurrection and this will be Mishima My faction of choice will be playing with these guys uh, Well, what can I say about this? Uh, why did I choose Mishima? Well, just, just one thing Samurais with shortcuts Enough said um, so, let's take a look at uh, what's included in the box. Uh, the artwork, the first thing you can see is, is nice, you can see the minis in the back, a bit of backstory, the content, uh, good addition, Protoss games, by the way, uh, adding a couple of dice, 20, 20 side uh, dice, which sometimes could be a bit difficult to come across. Mm, before uh, before I continue, uh, apologies also for the obvious choice of, of music, uh, Japan, Mishima, mm, Japanese music, but what the heck, it gives a, a bit of an ambience. Okay, so this is the box, um, yeah, it's, it's a box, so opening it, uh, careful with, oops, it tore. So, bubble wrap. Uh, the minis are well protected, so good addition as well. Uh, so, here are the bases, different sizes for the different units. You can uh, think you can make out Preview. dice. Yep, there they are. Uh, so, good. And here's the hero for Mishima, Captain Hirok. So, uh, once again, Protoss Game is doing an amazing job with the casting, well, the sculpting, of course, and the casting of these resin miniatures, because look at that. I'll, I'll get a closer look, because the camera in my phone can't really focus very well. Here we go. Look at that. Take a look at the folds in his Hakama, his samurai trousers, the armor, the Chon Mage, the, uh, which is the Japanese traditional hairdo. Uh, also, the uh, sniper rifle that he uses. Look at that. Well, the focus is not great, sorry about that. Light is not also very good, but you get the idea. Uh, it also comes with a couple of submachine guns, uh, katanas. Oh, and here we go. The, um, the 10 uh, Ronin Samurai. Which is like the infantry for for Mishima. Look at these beauties. Detail is just out of this world. Absolutely fantastic. We'll get a closer look again. Look at this guy. Pouches, the armor, the expression in his face also. I'm not showing you the the arms and uh, all the different weapons because I want I want to keep the video relatively short. Show you another one. Half assembled so you get the idea. With his katana ready for action. A lot of the straps even in the back of the of the leg armor. And moving on to the last unit in the starter box which is the mecha. What is essentially a tank on legs? It's an absolute monster. I don't remember of uh, of by heart his stats, but in game uh, this thing is pretty much unstoppable. Um, so the first weapon that you can see already is uh, sword, a big fat sword <laughs> that split you in two. Uh, we'll get a closer look as well. Take a look at that. Again, I have to mention the detail, the little machinery and uh, what you call them, servos and engines, whatever. You know, they're absolutely perfectly, perfectly detailed. Um, so here's one of the legs. Take a look at that. Preview. Oh, this is absolutely great, great stuff. This is the other arm, which is a minigun. Here's the focus. Yep. 
Look at that. Great, great stuff. Great resin minis. And that's it. That's what's in the box. Nothing else in the box. Wrap. Nope. So here we go. Right. So that's uh, that's what's in the box. Generally speaking, fantastic, fantastic, uh, fantastic starter box. Uh, the miniatures are absolutely fantastic. Love them. Love them. Um, the only thing um, I would have loved some assembly instructions because it can be a bit confusing at times, but they're not really a big deal. Um, so all things considered, you know, for the price and for the quality, you know, really, really good quality and a really, really good starter box. So in the next episode, the other faction, capital. <laughs>